Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we are talking about app subscriptions and more specifically, I'm going to answer a question that I've gotten a lot lately. And that is how do you find what subscriptions you have to applications on your iPhone? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, this is going to be a really quick video. There's really not too many steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video, but why would you want to find what subscriptions you have to various apps on your iPhone? Well, that's pretty easy. Maybe you're snooping through somebody's phone and you think they might have dating apps on their iPhone and you want to make sure whatever the case is, is a pretty easy process. It's all handled here in the settings app on your iPhone. It's this gray gear wheel icon looking thing. Check my video description. I'll try to leave the written instructions there as well, but I'm going to open up my settings app now. Okay, guys, I went ahead and open up the settings app. This is the drop down menu that you will see, but in order to find out what subscriptions you have for various apps on your Apple ID, you want to click here on the top. It should be your name and your Apple ID. ID. Okay, once you click there, you're going to get the drop down menu to your Apple ID. And in order to find out what subscriptions you have attached to your Apple ID, you want to click on this button right here called subscriptions. Okay, guys, I went ahead and clicked there. Next, you're going to see a long list of different subscriptions that you have set up with your Apple ID. They are broken down into active subscriptions here at the top, along with what the price is. And you can also see what inactive subscriptions, which would mean prior subscriptions that you had on your iPhone. So there you have it, guys. If you're looking to find out what subscriptions you have attached to your Apple ID, that is the easiest way I know how to find it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel and I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.